ex Ryder Cup player and open runner-up Osterhaus dies. The Englishman was twice a runner-up at the Open in 1974 and it was also in 1982 and he topped the European Tours Order of Merit from 1971 to 1974. He later became a television commentator. He was diagnosed with Alzheimer's disease. It was in 2014, 10 years ago, he was diagnosed. His former Ryder Cup teammate Bernard Galasher said, This is an incredibly sad day for everyone who was lucky enough to know Peter, but also for the game of golf as a whole. Following a successful amateur career, Westerhouse turned professional in 1968. He finished in a tie for sixth in the 1970 Open at St. Andrews, where Jack Nicholas beat Doug Sanders in a playoff. He took a three-shot lead to the, into the final round of the 1973 Masters, but a closing 74 left him in a tie for third. Two shots behind winner Tommy Aaron. All six of his Ryder Cup appearances are in defeat at a time of American dominance, but he beat Arnold Palmer, Johnny Miller, Jason Sneed, and Gene Littler in singles. I played alongside Pete at Boys, youths and senior meta level, all the way through to being his partner in the 1971 Ryder Cup in Missouri, where we combined to beat Lee Trevino and Billy Kasper before he went on to win both his singles matches, including beating Arnold Palmer. Galasha said, Peter was an incredibly intelligent golfer. Dedicated to his craft and to practice, he excelled in course management and putting which made him a very difficult opponent to get the better of. He was also a very intelligent man and a lovely person to be with in company. This sport news from BBC. Please subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching.